Hello, this is John Payne from Mercedes Benz York looking at a smart passion uh, soft touch and uh, it looks in good order for a 52 plate. Um, let's take it around it. Uh, front here, we've got some uh, scratches and scuffs down here. You can see a uh, small local repair, or maybe they'll polish out those. Uh, but the car's bright and shiny, seen some polish in its life, a little scratch there as well. Uh, this alloy at the front is uh, in uh, relatively good order, just a few light scratches on there as you can see. I'll probably leave that. Uh, the tyre is in good order, that's got 4 to 5 mil on it. Uh, this uh, wing mirror, as you can see, has got some scratches on it. Um, have a go at polishing them out, that should be okay. Oh, failing that, uh, I have to paint them. Um, this door, that's all in good order. Yeah, that's fine. Just looking at that. Yeah, very clean and tidy. A few little scratch marks on the chip on the door edge there, but otherwise okay. Let's just have a look down here. Yeah, that's fine, as you can see as well. Got If we get into here, we've got a few scuffs along in the inside. Nothing that won't polish out and some scratches here with people making contact with their feet as they uh, get out uh, but all things that are polish out um, or tidy up if you look on the eyes well we've got like a little bit of a scratch there uh, just uh, something sticking to it that's all fine that's okay light scratches to polish here around here light scratch there around here we've got some scuffs here 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 and as we get down onto this corner here, uh, this is a corner to uh, local repair on that corner. So that needs sorting out. Uh, alloy, they are very tidy, but if we're splitting airs, we've got some little uh, scratches here that need attending to. Um, and uh, on that back tire, we've got uh, three millimeter. Um, back window's okay, that's fine. No problems there. Parcel shelves in there as well. 52 plate as you can see. Lenses are okay. That one's okay. Yeah, no problem. Um, along here. Yeah, clean, tidy. Just some light scratches to polish. <laughs> as, as with every used car. Uh, that's just a corner fuel. Yeah, very clean and tidy. Um, just point out we've got a uh, panoramic. Uh, roof for this car as well i've got a spec listing car i'll show you it and uh, down here this wing that's fine a bit of a scuff there to sort there that's fine that arch let's have a look yeah clean alloy yeah minor things like the rest of the alloys um you could just touch in and just paint over nothing major to do uh that tire's in good order that's three to four mil uh, this door is uh, got a little bit of a scuff there, a little bit of a chip there. Uh, just going down here, that's something stuck to it. Sills underneath, just like. Let's just have a look inside and make sure it's all right. Yeah, look, just down here as well. A little bit. Of that. I think that's on the surface, to be fair. But as long as you've seen them, then you can uh, make a judgment and you know what needs doing. Uh, but I reckon they'll polish off. Um, Wing mirror, yeah, that's all right, no problem. Just a bit, a couple of chips to touch in. Front wing, that's fine. Clean and tidy on this side. Uh, this front alloy, mm, it's the worst one a lot, to be fair. It's got a bit of corrosion in there. Uh, so you probably would refurb that, but your tire's four to five mil, so that's good. Um, small local repair down here to so, uh, front of the car, oh this is in good order, no problem, um, yeah, a few chips to touch in, yeah, usual suspects on the front, little chip there, tiny minor things, uh, windscreen wipers, good order, yeah, okay, um, the actual windscreen, yeah, that's good, no problems. Um, so look inside. It's being looked after. 
definitely we can reach that conclusion anyway look inside it's very clean and tidy smells very fresh no problems uh, got two keys for the car and uh, let's just start her up make sure no red, red lights one second I will start her up in a second to just I'm just starting out again sometimes do all this there you go just have to take the key out and put it back in again right no problems at all so I've lost my mileage now so let's have a look it'll come back up in a second whilst the mileage is coming up what we'll do is uh, we'll look at the logbook 52 plate as you can see it's only had one owner in its life uh, that's running beautifully that's fine and um, it's uh, there you go 15th of the 10th 2002 okay uh, we've got an MOT certificate here saying October the 14th 2013 expiry and uh, if I just uh, show you the spec here there you go I'll just go down that nice and slow for you okay okay and uh, that's uh, relevant to be fair right um, service book we have got a healthy very healthy look all main dealer as you can see there and there and there and it's uh, 27th of the 9th uh, uh, 2012 at uh, 44,251 miles uh, I'll just try and get the mileage up one second it's somewhere on here um, they are, do change the models uh, one second um, right I can't see mileage so what I'll do there's no red lights or anything like that at the minute so what I'll do I think there's a button top of here that's it yeah there you go um, 48,712 miles in total last serviced at 44,251 miles it's done very little mileage in its life and as you can see all the services have been kept bang up to date so you know the engine sounds absolutely fantastic it's, uh, it's absolutely spot on equipment level you know it's not much but there you go that's what you get and it's an automatic box and you've got the pan roof and that slides okay that's fine all the upholstery inside is in good order um, give it a proper clean it'll be bang on it will be really nice as you can see across the dashboard as well very clean and tidy all right all your book packs are on, the, on there as well so there you go um, very little work to do in it actually most of it can be put right with uh, uh, machine polishing to be fair a uh, couple of local repairs granted but uh, not a lot of spend at all thank you very much